Are you left-handed, a smoker, or short-sighted? What if I told you that the development of these traits could in fact be influenced by the time of year you were born? Now this may send alarm bells ringing for some of you, but don't worry, I'm not about to jump on the astrology train. I'm not gonna talk about alignment of planets or anything like that. Rather, I am talking about something called the seasonal birth effect. This is where development of certain characteristics are linked to your birth date. For instance, if you're born in summer, studies have suggested you're more likely to be a smoker or short-sighted, and actually you're less likely to suffer from schizophrenia or be left-handed than those who are born in winter. At the moment, we can only hypothesize about these findings, whether or not there actually is a causal link behind it. Um, it's likely that things such as climate, diet, exposure to sunlight or lack of it all contribute towards these findings. Because these can affect things like hormone levels and gene expression in pregnant women, and this can influence the development of the baby. In the case of left-handedness and schizophrenia, studies have found strong seasonal birth links between those who conceived in May and June and then born in the winter. Studies suggest that this might be due to increased exposure to sunlight in women during early pregnancy. This increased solar radiation can lead to a buildup of toxic compounds through a process called oxidative stress. It's thought that this increase in oxidative stress can affect the development of brain lateralization. Brain lateralization is where one side of the brain takes dominance over the other. Now in most cases, it's the left hemisphere that dominates. And this is why, generally speaking, most people are right-handed, because your left hemisphere controls the right side of the body, and vice versa. However, many of those with schizophrenia tend to have reduced brain lateralization and concurrently are more likely to be left-handers. One study that looked at American baseball players found that strong left-handers, that is those that batted and pitched with their left hand, were more likely to be born in the winter months, with strong right-handers tending to be born in the summer months. So what does all of this actually mean? Well, I think we need to take it with a pinch of salt, because our information gathered isn't powerful enough to prove causality. We can't say, for example, why these things are actually happening at all. We can't say that being born in winter definitely contributes towards suffering from schizophrenia. All we know is that there's a link in the data sets that have been analysed. So while it's reasonable to assume, taking all of this information into account, that your health and your physiology can be influenced by your birth date, in reality these variations are very small and are probably only ever visible when looking across large population numbers. With so many variables to consider, it's very difficult to isolate seasonality as the sole cause for any of these characteristics. So the take home message for this is not to worry about it and certainly don't let your birth date define who you are. Let's leave that one to the astrologists.